Welcome to Trending Places. Today we will talk about Benedictine Abbey in Tiny and Krakow, Poland. The abbey is located on a hill overlooking the Vistula River, about 10 km west of Krakow. It is easily accessible by car or by public transportation. The abbey is part of the Worldwide Benedictine Order, which is a monastic order founded by Saint Benedict of Nursia in the 6th century. The order is known for its emphasis on community, prayer, and work and its members follow the rule of Saint Benedict, which is a set of guidelines for monastic life. The Benedictine Abbey in Tyniak is a monastery located in the village of Tyniak, near Krakow, Poland. It was founded in the 11th century by King Boleslaus II of Poland, and has a long and rich history. of religious and cultural life in the region for centuries, and it remains an active monastery to this day. The abbey is known for its beautiful architecture, which reflects a mix of Romanesque and Gothic styles. It is home to a number of important historical and cultural artifacts, including a collection of medieval manuscripts and illuminated texts. The abbey also has a rich tradition of music, and the monks have been known to perform choral music and other works in the abbey's chapel. The abbey has undergone several renovations and expansions over the centuries, and it has a mix of architectural styles. The oldest part of the abbey is the Romanesque church, which dates back to the 11th century. The church has a distinctive round design and is decorated with frescoes and murals. The abbey also has a Gothic cloister and a Baroque library. In addition to its religious and cultural activities, the abbey is also involved in charitable work and education. The monks run a primary school and a high school on the abbey grounds, and they also provide assistance to the local community through various charitable programs. In addition to its religious and cultural significance, the Benedictine Abbey in Tyniak is a popular tourist destination in the Krakow region. Visitors can tour the abbey and its grounds, attend mass or other religious services, and visit the abbey's gift shop. The abbey is also home to a restaurant and a small hotel, where visitors can stay while exploring the region. The abbey is open to visitors year-round, and guided tours are available in several languages. The abbey's chapel and other religious spaces are open to visitors during designated hours, and mass and other religious services are held regularly. Visitors can also visit the abbey's museum, which displays a variety of artifacts and historical documents related to the abbey's history. Thanks for watching our video. Do like and subscribe and keep watching all our videos.